You know, when you talk about a nation, the interest of a nation, you're talking about very long term. You don't look at the needs of today alone. It is important, but you have to look at the long term need. So sustainability is really to improve the well-being, whether it's economic or whatever, in the long run. And the United States has reached a level of development where I really feel you need not worry about, you know, having to catch up or being left behind by anybody. Your strength now is in the, you, you have all the resources in the world. You have high technology. So that is where your strength is, not polluting to, to, to become richer. And in fact, uh, the, the, the global blame game nowadays is that, well, the rich, for the reason that you mentioned, they don't want the development to, uh, let us say, slow down. But the poorer countries are also now saying, look, we must be allowed to emit more carbon because we have to catch up. On per capita basis, our emission levels are very low. We have poverty to handle. But again there, in some ways it is true that they have very urgent problems to resolve, which could be slowed if you have to take into account all these environmental issues. But on the other hand, looking at development as a very long-term objective, long-term necessity, I, I think you must really not uh, compromise the future for the present, because you will suffer at some stage later on. And unfortunately now, whether you are a rich country or a poor country, it really doesn't matter who emits this uh, poison, this pollution, United, United States or Bhutan or whatever. We are all being affected. We are all in the same sinking boat. So if the hold is from your side or my side, it makes no difference. We are going to go, go down together, you know. So I think we have to re uh, wake up to that reality. The democ democratic setup. I mean, you're elected for a few years only and you think of how to get back again. And I think that is a wrong attitude on the part of the politicians. You need also visionary politicians, politicians who look to the future. When you deal with national interests, you have to think long term. So you need good politicians.